Welcome to another episode of Let's Play Guitar. So today we're going to tackle Al Green's Let's Stay Together. Great song, full of uh, just smooth chords. There's going to be some uh, D9 in there, a G minor 9, which is fun. We've got one compound chord with a, 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 a C with a D in the bass. A very nice tune. If you're playing in a wedding band, corporate band, this gets people out on the dance floor. Gets those belly rubbers rubbing their bellies. So without any further ado, let's learn the chords to Let's Stay Together. All right, we're back. All right, it's good. the intro is gonna start with a B flat major seven. I like to tell some of my students, just think of the, uh, the way this is voiced. If you know your D minor chord, just your basic D minor, all we're gonna do is we're gonna leave these fingers alone, and we're gonna fret the sixth fret on the low E with our one finger, and we're gonna mute the A string. So all together, we got our one finger on the sixth fret low E, muting the A. Our three fingers on the seventh fret D string, our pinky is on the seventh fret G string, and then our two fingers tucked in on the sixth fret B string. second chord is an A minor 7. I choose to bar it. I don't put the fifth in there. I'm just barring this one. I think that's the voicing they use in the recording. And that one is your two finger on the low E fifth fret. We're going to mute the A string again and then we're going to bar down the rest of the strings. The third chord is a G minor 7. Same exact voicing but this time we're just starting it on the third fret. Second finger on the low E, G on the third fret. We're going to mute the A and then we're going to bar down from the D string. And then it comes back up to the A minor 7 again and then it starts over on the B, B flat major 7. Together that intro sounds like with a C dominant 7 and a C dominant 7 is like playing your basic C major chord but now we're going to put our pinky in at the third fret on the G string so all together Now the verse. The verse is going to start in F major. It's just your basic E form bar chord, F major. And I like to pick out uh, some of the notes in there. I kind of play just real soft and slow. It's such a pretty song. And then it goes to a C with a D in the bass. This chord is surprisingly easy to play because it only takes one finger. So what I'm going to do is I'm not really playing the high E, which would be the, the A on top of that C chord. I'm not really going to play that. We're just going to play from the A string, 5th fret, that's your D, and then we're going to bar straight down to the B. So the two chords together. Now the third chord in that verse, we're going to go to a B flat major. But I'm only playing the top of the chord instead of the full chord. I'm just playing the top. So I'm going to start with my three finger and I'm going to play this triad here in B flat major. And that's three finger D string eighth fret, two finger seventh on the G, one finger is barring the high, uh, the B and the high E on the sixth fret. And now, a really cool, interesting turn is they turn this into a B minor, B flat minor, with an add nine. And I just play that by barring one, and I put my pinky down on the eighth fret. So I'm barring from the D down on the sixth, on that B, B flat minor, and then I add my pinky in there. And then what I do is a little, uh, before I start with this transition chords uh, at the end of the verse, I do a little uh, Watch that again. So 
So those first chords through the verse, they sound like this. Now from there, uh, where it kind of transitions, it goes to an A minor 7, a voicing that we've already talked about, to the G minor 7, another voicing we already talked about, to the F major, and now an E minor, and E minor I'm just playing it low E open, I'm fretting on my, with my 2 and 3 finger, I'm fretting the 2nd fret on the A string and the 2nd fret on the D string. And so that D9 is two finger on the fifth fret, one finger on the fourth fret D string. So one, two fingers on the A at the, at the fifth fret. One finger is on the D string at the fourth fret. And then I'm barring down the GBE at the fifth fret with my three finger. So that pass again, A, starting with the A minor seven, G minor seven, F major. E minor, D9. Same pass again, but this time instead of uh, going to the E, we're going to go right back to the A minor. So it sounds like this. So we just replace the E minor that we do on the first pass. We come back to A minor on the second pass and then the D9. Okay, so the whole the whole verse uh, sounds like this. Play along with me. Two, three, four. And then it's on to the second verse, exact same chord progression again. Now, when it goes to the chorus, to the Let's Stay Together portion, we're going to slide up and play a, one of my favorite chords. I just love the sound of it. It's a uh, minor nine chord. So it's like playing a, like, like how we played that D9. What we're going to do is we're going to slide up to the 10th fret, G, on the A string. But this time, instead of our two finger being on a, what would be a dominant nine, we're going to slide our two finger back to the eighth fret. So our one finger is our two finger is on the A string G at the tenth fret. Our one finger is on the D string at the eighth fret, and then we're going to bar down G B E on the tenth. That's a G minor nine, and we're going to slide that up through the chorus to an A minor seven. So this voicing for an A minor 7, pretty typical. Uh, I'm barring the A string at the uh, 12th fret all the way down. I got a bar going in there. With my 3 finger, I'm fretting the D string on the 14th fret. And I'm fretting the uh, B string on the 13th fret. There's our A minor 7. Okay. So through the chorus, you're going to be playing... Back to G minor 9, and then it's like the intro, B flat major 7, A minor 7, G minor 7, A minor 7, and right to the top, F, F major. Okay, I hope that lesson was helpful. Uh, please like and subscribe. Leave any comments below. Uh, I find this song to be uh, just a perennial favorite. Every year we play this song, people always dance to it. They love it. If you haven't added it into your dance band yet, it's time to do so. 
Al Greens, let's stay together. All right, boys, let's play guitar. Woo!